Spielberg's choice was Michael Christian's novel before it was even published. Not a real T-Rex, the T-Rex's roar was a mix of elephant, tiger, alligator, and other animal sounds. Phil Tippett's job changed from stop motion to CGI consultation after seeing a CGI demo. No actual dinosaurs were in the film. They were all animatronics or CGI. Two major errors Velociraptors were much smaller, and T-Rex's vision wasn't based on movement. Hammond's ice cream is a nod to Ben and Jerry's, a brand Spielberg loves. Gear. Grant's fear of flying reflects Spielberg's real-life fear until his 60s. Dilophosaurus venom is fictional. In reality, we don't know if it spit venom. Initial budget was $63 million, but the film grossed over $900 million worldwide initially. The park's location is on the fictional Isla Nublar, near Costa Rica. Hurricane Niki halted production in Hawaii, but resulted in authentic storm scenes. No sequel planned, Christian initially had no intentions for a sequel, but fan demand changed that. Only 15 minutes of dinosaur screen time exist in the two hour long movie. Spielberg's dedication, the film is dedicated to post-production supervisor Michael Kahn's mother. The Raptors kitchen scene took about three weeks to shoot because of the complexities. Mocap wasn't used, the CGI team used rubber models to create the computer graphics. Real paleontologist Jack Horner was a consultant, ensuring some scientific accuracy. The iconic water ripple was achieved using a guitar string under the dashboard. Mr. DNA's voice is the same as the narrator for the Disneyland Spaceship Earth ride. Nedry's wardrobe is similar to the Goonies chunk, a nod to Spielberg's involvement in Goonies. Spielberg cameo is as a background character in the Disite scene. Raptor's vocalizations were created using Portis mating sounds. Animatronic T-Rex sometimes malfunctioned in the rain, giving unintended scares. Real mosquitoes in amber were used, but none were actually from the Jurassic era. John Williams composed the iconic theme song in just a few days. Objects in Mirror Mirror Sticker was added for humor and isn't standard on cars. Spielberg and Christian collaborated before on the TV show. -er. The mosquito bite on Hammond's hand is a nod to the film's mosquito in amber concept. Film's premiere was held at the Uptown Theater in Washington, D.C. Animatronic raptors often had human puppeteers inside to achieve certain movements. Jaws reference is when a great white shark is eaten by the Mosasaurus in Jurassic World, Spielberg's other film. England, the company name stands for International Genetics Incorporated. Sam Neill's scream when the T-Rex roars in his face was genuine due to unexpected loudness. The T-Rex paddock appears to be at ground level, but moments later has a massive drop. It's a film continuity error. Spielberg earned around $250 million from the film, more than any other director for a single film at that time. The sick Triceratops was a fully practical animatronic that required several operators. Galimimus' flocking scene was inspired by nature footage of ostriches running. Spielberg wasn't first director choice. Joe Dante and Tim Burton were considered earlier. Jurassic Park's success led to Universal Studios creating a themed ride in 1996. Lexus computer system uses a real software, Unix system, to locate the park's power grid. 
Paleobotanist Ili identifies a West Indian Lila which doesn't exist in reality. The script went through numerous rewrites, including a version where Hammond was a villain. The goat leg scene was the most complex shot in the film, blending animatronics and CGI. Spielberg wanted realism, so many animatronics were created by Stan Winston's team. The film's logo was designed by San Ecolora and became instantly iconic. Velociraptor's claws tapping sound was created using hollow cut bamboo. Before final edit, the film had more scenes, which were either cut or never shot for pacing reasons. D-Rex's broken fence was inspired by a childhood nightmare Spielberg had about Rex from Toy Story crashing into his home. The shaving cream can that Ned reuses hides the secret compartment for stolen embryos. Christian's book was sold at auction for $1.5 million to Universal, setting a record for a novel's film rights.